Hello ladies and gentlemen and thank you again for watching another DC Universe Online video. So this is going to be the volcano hideout that you can get in Lex Tower. That's going to be in the solo after going to the transporter terminal and waiting for the duration of time to make it cool down so you can get this situation. So what's going to happen, Clock Watcher is going to be the feat when you collect it and this is what's going to happen and take place. So what you do is you got to go to your base and you have to collect the situation and when you collect it you can go there and move your relocation base and get to the location that you want to make your new base. This hideout is pretty small but for the most part it's going to do exactly what it's going to do for every base that you're looking for and more okay so when i mean more it's going to give you a new look and a new transition into the game but first of all i just wanted to let you guys know if you're doing pvp and you're doing layers you need to get deeds so you can make sure you can get a proper looking base with three levels with a bigger surrounding and getting a bigger situation this goes down to the first generation of bases where it looked very small and compact okay this is a small compact space so please take notice in this situation everything is so close to each other you need a bigger base to put yourself in a position where you can do layers in pvp so you can use this you can try this this is something that you can get in the new t10s birds of prey dlc solos lex tower okay so this is basically what you're going to get when you get this and you wait for the duration of the time of the cooldown for that situation you gotta wait at least 30 minutes and you will get this this is a really neat and nice looking base i will show you the way that i fill it up with all the items that i have and i'll see you guys soon my name is chris dash see you guys with another video